Hi everyone, this is Paige from Zoom. The ZUM2 mic provides you with excellent audio quality whether you are virtually attending a professional meeting, personal gathering, or educating over teleconferencing software. Making sure the person on the other end of your call can hear you clearly will ensure that your message is delivered. In this video, I will show you how to use your ZUM2 with teleconferencing software including Zoom, Skype, Discord, Microsoft Teams, and Google Meet. First, we will go through the initial connection of your ZUM2 with your computer. After that, you can select the chapter in the video that covers the software that you want to use. To connect your ZUM2 with your Windows computer, plug one end of the included USB cable into the ZUM2 and the other end directly into the USB port on your computer. Alternatively, you can use a USB-C to USB-C cable. Next, open Settings, select System, then Sound. Here, you can choose the ZUM2 as your input and output device. Choosing the ZUM2 as your playback device will allow you to hear your computer audio through the headphone jack on the ZUM2. Once these steps are complete, you're ready to use the ZUM2 with your teleconferencing software. If you're using a Mac, plug one end of the included USB cable into the ZUM2 and the other end directly into the USB port on your computer. Alternatively, you can use a USB-C to USB-C cable. Next, open System Preferences and select Sound. On this screen, first select the Input tab and choose the ZUM2. Then, select the Output tab and choose the ZUM2 again. Choosing the ZUM2 as your playback device will allow you to hear your computer audio through the headphone jack on the ZUM2. Once these steps are complete, you're ready to use your ZUM2 with your teleconferencing software. If you're using Zoom, launch the app on your computer and select the icon with your initials on the top right of this window. In this dropdown, select Settings. Next, select the Audio tab and choose the ZUM2 as the speaker and microphone. Once this is done, you can test the speaker and microphone to confirm. Then, close out of this window and join your Zoom meeting. If you want to change your speaker or microphone mid-meeting, you can click the up arrow next to the microphone symbol and then select a different microphone or speaker from that list. If you're using Skype, launch the app on your computer. On the top left of this window next to your username, click on the three dots and then select Settings. In this window, select the Audio and Video tab. In the Audio section of this tab, select the ZUM2 as your microphone and speaker. Once this selection is made, you can test to confirm. Then, close out of this window and join your Skype call. If you would like to change your input or output source mid-meeting, you can click on the three dots in the lower right corner. A new window will open, and then you'll scroll to the audio section and change the input and output source. If you're using Discord, launch the app on your computer. On the bottom left of this window, next to your username, select the gear icon to access the settings menu. Here, select voice and video under app settings. In the voice settings, select the ZUM2 as the input and output device. Once this selection is made, you can test the microphone to confirm. Then, close out of this window to return to the home screen of Discord and join your server. If you want to change your input or output device mid-call, you can follow the same steps as earlier. Select the gear icon, select voice and video, and then choose your new input and output device. If you're using Microsoft Teams, launch the app on your computer. Click on your icon on the top right of the window and select Settings. In this window, select the Devices tab. Under Audio Devices Settings, select the ZUM2 as the speaker and microphone. Once this selection is made, you can test the speaker and microphone to confirm. Close out of this window and join your call. To change your input or output source mid-meeting, select the three dots labeled More Options. Then, select Show Device Settings. 
In this section, you can change your input and output sources. If you're using Google Meet, launch the app on your computer. On the top right of this window, select the gear icon. Now, select the audio tab and set the ZUM2 as the microphone and speaker. Once this selection is made, you can test the microphone and speaker to confirm. Now, you can close out of the settings window and join your call. To change your input and output settings mid-meeting, select the three dots in the lower right corner of your screen and select Settings. Select the Audio tab in that window and adjust your input and output sources. To learn more about the ZUM2 USB mic, check out the other videos on our YouTube channel and visit our website at zoomcorp.com. Good luck and enjoy creating.